So Pokemon Sun and Moon introduced the feature of permanent rideable Pokemon. X and Y had rideable Pokemon, but they were only available for a specific area. Ultra Sun and Moon has a very high possibility of bringing back rideable Pokemon again. We might get the same ones, brand new ones, or a combination of old and new. I mean, I think it would be pretty cool if we could get some new rideable Pokemon. Today, I will be counting down some of these new rideable Pokemon. I want to see whether it be land, air, or sea. But with that being said, let's saddle up and start this countdown. So in Sun and Moon, we didn't really have any super giant Pokemon to ride on. Let's bring a giant Pokemon to the scene and destroy many things such as beaches and just, you know, interrupt the whole entire lives of people on the beach. I'm kidding, let's not do that. I want to ride Stilix though. I can imagine riding Stilix over mountain ranges to clear rocks out of the way or taking some kind of underground path. So no remix confirmed? We had Mudsbray and Sun and Moon, it was way too slow. How about we bring out a real horse Pokemon, or should I say Unicorn? Let's ride Rapidash and get to places way faster than Tauros did. Rapidash could be useful for hopping over some crazy obstacles, maybe from rock to rock, or it could even jump over hurdles or multiple ledges at once. Also, what about a Rapidash race trial? This would blow away the Pokeathlon dome and you'd be able to ride and control Rapidash rather than tapping on your screen. I mean, it's also a reference to Ash in that one episode where he races with Rapidash and wins against that Dodrio. We got Lapras and Sharpedo. Now it's time we get the giant sea monster Pokemon Gyarados. Gyarados can obviously be used to surf on and it can destroy big land masses that could get in the way. It's also giant. We need more giant Pokemon to ride on. Stilix wouldn't be enough. Gyarados for water, Stilix for land. I also wouldn't mind if sea trainers would get scared of Gyarados and we wouldn't have to battle them. I mean, seeing them run away would be kind of funny, I'll be completely honest. Honestly, can we just have Gyarados? I don't want to battle sea trainers anymore. It didn't get a Mega, and I don't think it ever will at this rate, which kind of sucks. Can we at least get Flygon as a rival of Pokemon? Is it that hard, Ken Sugimori? Or will we have Artist Block for this one, too? Seriously, Flygon needs love, or some spotlight again one way or another. I want to fly on this beautiful Dragon Pokemon over Alola. Instead of pleasing all the Gen owners of Charizard, give the Gen 3 years Flygon and not Salamence. The Croissant Mega Evolution was dumb and it was not needed, though I do love Altarius. Could we also get some activities for the flying Pokemon? Like Tauros can smash boulders, Stoutlin can find items, Lapras can dash, and Sharpedo can also break rocks. Can Flygon fly through canyons and destroy plots of land and do some fancy flying tricks through crevices? All Charizard did was fly. Fly. I want the fly Pokemon to get more to do than just fly. Even if we don't though, Flygon deserves the fly ride Pokemon slot. Let's go Flygon. Gen 1 or not, call me a hypocrite for calling out Charizard, but we need to be able to ride on Arcanine. It's everyone's dream to ride on Arcanine. Game Freak could totally make it into a rideable Pokemon. Its Pokedex entries even say it's fast. Let's test that theory. Arcanine could easily replace Tauros. Rather than destroying boulders or obstacles, it could elegantly jump over them. Do you guys remember Wolf Link from Twilight Princess and how it could jump up cliffs and stuff like that? We could get that with Arcanine and jump around all over the place. I don't think it will happen because 3DS can't handle it. Although, however, if Sun and Moon were for the Switch, <laughs> the Switch is better. But yeah, Arcanine, rideable Pokemon. Make it happen. It would make riding a lot more fun and would satisfy a lot of fans, I think. Well, those are five Pokemon I want to ride in Pokemon Ultra Sun and Moon. Will this happen? I mean, if you could, yeah. I just want to fly on Flygon and ride an Arcanine. I think that would satisfy a lot of fans. Also, giving the Pokemon more activities would make riding more fun as well. What kinds of Pokemon would you want to ride, and what kinds of activities would you guys like to do? Share your thoughts in the comments below. If you enjoyed this video, why not subscribe and leave a like if you want to see some more Pokemon content. But with that being said, I'm done here today. I'm Mr. Gumbreon, and I will see you guys next time.